Thanksgiving night. Uh, look ahead was 10 and a half. It got bought up a little bit, but now we're kind of right back where we started. Um, the Niners, we, we were talking about it last week. Uh, I, I thought once we reached three, obviously that was kind of the stopping point, but it wasn't a stopping point for San Francisco because the three did not matter. They won by, I think, 24, what was it, 42, 19? They won by 25 points, excuse me, 25 points. Doing my math here on the fly. Um, and the Seahawks D got kind of pushed around by Dallas's offense, gave up over 400 yards. Um, Seattle did cover that game last Thursday night in Dallas, but they lost outright 41, 35. Again, this is the return matchup from a few weeks ago on Thanksgiving night. The Niners, uh, won this game by 18 points. They covered on the road as a seven point favorite. San Francisco owns this rivalry guys. They've won four straight covered four straight. We're all kind of passing on it, though. I'm assuming, Fez, the number just a little bit too heavy to play the yeah, Niners in this ch- Check your abacus, my friend, on the uh, on, on the mathematics there. Um, but it, that really doesn't matter. They won by more than 20. Um, let's, yeah. um, let's pull back the curtain here. 23. <laughs> so, Se- so Seattle um, <laughs> was catching seven, and they got crushed, right? So we got to make an adjustment and what that line would be had the, should they replay this game in Seattle? Let's bump it two points, and we'll go to nine, right, based upon what we saw two weeks ago. Well, both teams kicked butt last week versus expectations, yeah. so let's keep it nine. And now we're going to flip home fields. Home field's worth one and a half in each direction, and we get to 12. So with this line at 10 and a half, we'd say, all right, the Niners look to have a little bit of value, but it's a really bad spot, as good a spot as it was for the yeah. Niners Last week against the Eagles, now the Niners are a little fat, drunk, and happy, having just beaten this team two weeks ago and then having crushed um, in Philly last week. So that's got to be worth about about a point and a half. So I'm right back to, I think the line is basically right. Full disclosure, this is how pros bet. I'm sorry. I know you want the right side. And from the bottom of my heart, I'm sorry that I have not done better in my bets that I've given out here on this particular show. But um, I played plus 12 and a half. A well-known sports handicapper gave that out. And I grabbed plus 12 and a half. And it went down to 10 and a half. And one book ticked to minus 10, reduced VIG. And I was like, heck yeah. Slammed the minus 10, minus 105 back the other way. And that's just how pros bet. Oftentimes, both sides getting value. I pass. Chris. Not a yeah, it's, here, a, it's 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 it, it, you're exactly right. I was just having a, uh, a a board rundown discussion with somebody that I work with uh, to bounce ideas off of, and we're on opposite sides of this game uh, at different numbers and uh, different betting techniques, and uh, uh, we're perfectly happy with our positions. And it's uh, I love San Francisco to just win this game, so it's. Uh, I love it in a 10 point teaser. Uh, I'm using it probably in a variety of different ways and I feel pretty darn confident in it. They're the better team. They're the the better team against any team in the NFL by at least a couple of points at this point, if they stay healthy, nobody's stopping them. So uh, it's just a matter of uh, them being able to stay healthy. I respect Seattle. They've got good coaching. They did come in with the with the good effort last game out, but uh, uh, they're still, you know, trending downward, downward, downward for weeks, and uh, they've got a tough road to even make the playoffs. They're underdogs to make the playoffs at this point, and uh, I, I, I actually, if I had to, I would bet San Francisco actually finds a way to cover this spread. Uh, it wouldn't surprise me at all, but I'm using them in that uh, three-team teaser that starts off with Pittsburgh and has Tampa Bay plus 12 and a half, and I will find other uses for it also. Love it. Yeah, I, I went the wrong way on my math there, guys. I appreciate the people in the chat that that got on me for that. I know 4219 is 23. You try hosting a show on the fly while also doing math in your head and tell me how easy it is. Um, also a great point. If you're in the chat right now and you haven't liked our video yet, please click the like button. It takes like a split second and it helps our metrics. So always support the show. If you're in the chat, interacting with us, you're getting information, hit that like button as well, because we really appreciate the engagement. Um, no play for me here. No play for Fez. Chris is putting the Niners in a 10 point teaser. And I agree with you, Chris. I think San Francisco Baltimore is my Super Bowl pick today. If I uh, gun in my head, had to pick it. So Niners uh, probably find a way to cover this number. <laughs>